Oh my gosh, you know pole vault? It's what I'm doing. Good morning, guys. Good morning. You ready to go to school? Yeah, okay. But can't the family be seen that if they get to see? I see the bus. <laughs> Wake up, baby. Come on. You you fell asleep on the couch upstairs after you got up already. We gotta go take a bath now. This is what happens when you wake up at 4 a.m., huh? How's my little bunny doing? I like how you made her purple. That is so cool. Now what's she gonna do? So, Maggie has the day off, no one else does, and she enjoyed our last special day so much that we are gonna have another special day. She's kind of been waiting for this. Um, Maggie, guess what it's time for? Maggie and Mommy's day? So Maggie and I are starting out our very special day right now. Ready to go? Should we go to McDonald's first? And then Dollar Tree. She has this all planned out for us and has for a while. Are you gonna want an orange or a pink sh smoothie? Pink. Wait, you said orange before. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'll do pink. Maggie had a cinnamon roll and a fruit smoothie. And now we are waiting for Dollar Tree to open because we got up here so fast that it's still 19 minutes until they open. What are you doing up here? Okay, 14 more minutes. It feels like it's a long wait, huh? It's like a little frosty. So we're yeah, just hanging out. Good job. Yep, no balloon. Not today. You already have balloons. Oh, I like those. They're so pretty. Which one's Una? So Maggie got quite the little haul of stuff. Okay, I got a lot of stuff. Yes, I think if it was possible, she was even more excited this time. So I did not film very much. I filmed a little bit though, but we had a great time. She picked out some stuff, some balloons, some stickers, some coloring books. We found two bubble guppy books in there. I got some organization stuff. She also picked out sandals, socks, and a cup. Just get broken in our house a lot, and so I think we get an emoji cup every time we come to Dollar Tree. Not today. Where are we going now? We're gonna go home. We're gonna open our stuff. We're gonna wait for Nanny, and then we're gonna go to lunch. Sound good? Yeah. Let's go. Come on, I got your stuff. Let's go straight inside, okay? Good job, bro. Mm. Oh, did we drop something? Did I step on it? Mm. Oh, your shoe, I'm sorry. You like those Maggie, shoes though, huh? Go, go, go. Uh-oh, Maggie. Oh my gosh. Maggie. Apparently that was not as important as a shoe. Got our stuff. Hopefully the trash gets picked up soon. <laughs> Happy? You wanna take your harness off for now? You don't have to wear your harness today if you don't want to, huh? Please? What? Open? Yeah, we can open those. Here, let me put my phone down. So Maggie is playing with her toys. I have been using my dehydrator a lot more. Um, I've had this for a while and I used it a lot when we first got it and then I had Tessie, we moved and it's been sitting in my garage. So yesterday I got it out, I spent a long time cleaning it and I dehydrated spinach <laughs> because I want to make this into a powder that I can put in smoothies. I have smoothies a lot for breakfast that are just fruit, chia seeds. I really like the taste of chia seeds. I just put Libby down in her crate because we are going out. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's get in the car, okay? Not the door, Migs. No, Maggie, not Tessie's door, please. No, not today. Maggie, that's not the door. Where's no, Maggie? Not today. Nope, not today. Where's Maggie's door? Mm -hmm. Let's get in Maggie's door. Show me where it is. <laughs> Show me where Maggie's door is. Oh, yep. Now we are on our way. Ugh. I've got to get my dad to help me take that pile of cardboard to the local dump because it's too much to get picked up here. So yeah, now it is time for us to go. Ready, Megs? Good job getting in your seat.
Yep, thank you for putting that there. Let's go, Maggie's seat. You're on Maggie's seat. Let's go get Nanny. Come on, let's go inside. She is, she's ready. Look at, she's right there. Let's go see her. Hi. You want a sable? Hey. What? Are we gonna take our car? Probably. We have sunny days. Yeah, our car has sunny days, so that's a good idea. Oh. Hold Sammy now. Oh, those are shots nope. for the kitty. Those are shots for Sammy. Thank you, we're gonna go to Burgers. Dolls and Burgers. Know? Mm -hmm. Yep, not today. Maggie and I are, are here with Nanny at her favorite restaurant at the moment and she got a double bacon burger and I got a burger with bean and patty because it's Friday. I know, those are cute. Oh, that shirt you like? Yeah. Do you like that shirt? The other shirt. Okay. Nope, let's leave that on because we have to be able to buy it. You can have it after we buy it, okay? Oh yeah. Okay, so I'll carry it down for you. Like a car toy. Like a car toy. Oh, I know an aisle. There's an aisle with car toys. Okay, we're gonna go to it. I'm gonna go look at these. Okay, we'll be down there in a minute. Here we go. What color cars? Car toys. You said you wanted car, car toys. toys. Is there a certain day. color that you want? Car toys, sunny days. Sunny doy days, car toys. It wasn't the perfect day. It was a good day, but. We definitely had our moments. Um, probably the biggest one was a little communication problem. So we went to Target and Maggie liked sitting in the cart. I don't usually even have her sit in the cart, but it was available. The store was kind of quiet. Sometimes it can be a little bit overwhelming for her and for me when she's up and trying to just grab things to put in the cart because she's really starting to enjoy shopping. And so I thought maybe being able to sit in the car and be pushed around and tell me what she wanted because I, I told her we were going there um, and I had money that I'd set aside to get her like a toy, something small. And I wanted to let her pick out some clothes because she gets a ton of hand-me-downs from Sadie, but it's not very often that she gets to go to the store and really pick out things for herself. She announced that she wanted a car toy. I was thinking we'd go down the car aisle because there's this toy, it's like a little toy car that came with something that Tessie got. It's had no interest in the car but Maggie has loved that car and she puts dolls in it and she says this is Sadie's seat, mommy's seat, Tessie's seat. So when she said she wanted a car of her own I thought that's what she meant, a little car. <sighs> you may be able to tell from what I've said so far that that was not actually what she meant. Um, things were fine. She picked out like a less than ten dollar pack of matchbox cars. She was happy with them. She was talking about car toys. As we were walking down like one of the main aisles, they had a display that included giant boxes of power wheels. I think they're still called power wheels, just basically those big sit down riding cars. There's a big one at Nanny's house, Maggie has driven it. She likes it apparently when she asked for a car toy, she meant that sort of car toy. And of course I said, no, I don't have like $600 to drop on a car toy, especially when there's already one at Nanny's house. We don't have to deal with meltdowns very often, um, especially not in public. But I did learn some things today. <laughs> the first one is that having a six-year-old who's having a meltdown is very different from having an 11-year-old who's having a meltdown. Because when your six-year-old is having a meltdown, people look, people make rude comments, people shake their heads and look disgusted because they think that you have a brat that's having a temper tantrum. Um, when your 11-year-old is having a meltdown in a store, people don't look, no one looks at you. <laughs> Which honestly, I would prefer in the middle of a meltdown it that way, so that was better. Um, no one says anything mean. No one shakes their head. I'm glad it doesn't happen very often. Um, and I can understand why it is a little bit overwhelming because it's just something that we haven't done as much as we did before the pandemic and we're just slowly starting to get back into it. Just one of the good things about days like this. Overall, it was really fun. Not today. Hope not today. It's finished. I squirted in the mirror. 
Can, do you want to show your board? Hasqua and a bamboo. Unavailable. Hasqua and a bamboo. Unavailable. What's that, Mikey? Hasqua and a bamboo. Is that hard school? Is that hard school? Is that Maggie at hard school? Maggie at hard school? Hasqua and a bamboo. Unavailable today. Hasqua and a bamboo. Unavailable. Did you have a fun special day? Hard school is unavailable. Hard school is unavailable. Hard school is finished. It's finished. Hard school is finished. It is till Monday. Hard school is finished. Hard school is finished. Hard school is finished. The trip would cost, and it's in high school, so we have time to save up. How much? Are we ready, tiny one? Three thousand seven hundred. Okay.